In the Philips Grow Y Center, they can make plants grow faster, taste better, look better, and even make them healthier for you. In here, they study the conditions that are needed to grow a particular plant, captured in a growth recipe, and they analyze how plants respond to changes, resulting in growth recipes that create better results. It's up there on the third floor. That's where we've built our city farm. I would like to go up now and have a look. Within Philips Lighting, we've put a lot of effort into developing technologies that improve indoor farming practices. Before you can make the right choices, you have to understand the way a plant grows and how to optimize the different parameters in order to obtain specific characteristics and yield increases. In our Grow Ice Research Center, we can influence the growth of plants by controlling all parameters that affect plant growth. The success of a city farm depends on getting it right for a specific crop. It means not just getting the lighting right, but also optimizing all the other parameters, such as climate, nutrition, irrigation, software sensors. Link these technical settings to the ideal seeds, substrates, and the best recipe for that particular product can be developed. It all started with lighting, so we are a very knowledgeable company on lighting, and we are very successful in that. Over the years in LED lighting and horticulture we have built a team which is really focused on delivering the best solutions for the growers. We have plant specialists and they know everything about the interaction of lighting and growing crops. When you change lighting you change actually the whole mechanism in the plant itself. The plant reacts on different kinds of, of light, different colors of lights differently. It notices when the light color changes. You can create your optimal plant, but you can also steer the plant in the way you want. But that depends on the type of crop and of the variety of the crop, because not all plants react the same. And that's why we need to investigate a lot of crops here in Grow Eyes. So what you see over here is the overview of the facility. Uh, basically all the sensors are connected to this computer, so we track 80,000 data points. We use exactly the same photons as the sun, just optimized for the plant. We use the same water, but we recycle it, so we spoil less of the water. We use the same substrates, but everything in a controlled environment. So we keep out the bugs, we keep out the pests, and that's why we can optimize for taste, rather than picking crops that are extremely disease resistant. What if you could do all of this in a clean environment, all natural, year round? We can reduce waste, food miles, really produce clean, healthy and nutritious food in a resource efficient way. We can produce it exactly where the consumer needs it. We are in contact with a lot of growers and other people out of the food industry and they are all the time looking for new ways to produce healthy food. We have parties who are interested in growing in an indoor facility and what we basically do is that we start up a conversation with them why they are interested. Often the outcome is that they like to produce close to the cities in a very reproducible way full year round but in the end they also like to earn money with it. They want to have a positive business case. This is where city farming comes in. This is where we can provide a new group of customers with solutions to grow the right quality and quantity of fresh food. By optimizing per crop, focusing on the added value of the plants grown, we can help retailers and growers improve their offering to an increasing urban population.